is it too simplistic to, to say that those minutes are maybe catching up on some of the, the dairy legs or is, is that just I guess possibly, hindsight possibly and, and like what John's saying there there's no doubt that momentum plays a part here and, and especially in what what used to be the back door and now these preliminary games if you have week on week and if you're getting results sometimes that carries you through and the momentum just keeps you going and like there's no doubt on on the fitness of these guys this the inter-county football has went to another level and these boys live it every minute of the day and, and they're, in, they're in super shape and um, so it might not even be the legs it could be the mental side of things like what john saying there dublin and mayo last week a, a monster of a game and everybody talking about it and then you've got that quick come down after the game and then it's on to the next one and so it's dairy this weekend coming to coming to mayo and the press all talking about it and everyone talking about it and the build up to the game for for both sides you know it's it's and and dairy here obviously we've got all that talk about about management and issues and different things so like it's playing on these guys minds all the time so it's it's maybe not even the the physical stress and, and the physical tiredness it's it's maybe the mental side of things but that usually sorts itself out when you're on top and you're winning and when the confidence is high. But certainly the the Glen lads, for one, Glass, Ethan, Doherty, uh, McFall, they have a massive season and they've, they've tried to keep it going. Um, now I know that the, the Clifford boys maybe had something similar last year, didn't they? Where they where they played in the in the club finals and and then kept it going fairly quickly. So look, it's it's hard to know. It's hard to know. Uh, Sometimes when you're behind, uh, you look a bit more sluggish, and and people use the tiredness thing. But when when you're on top, and like these these Glen lads that I'm talking about, uh, Ethan Doherty maybe looks like he's he's on a bit of a slump, you're not not playing the same levels as he was playing last year. But that could come again. We're hoping we're hoping that comes again, and and we pick it up. And as John says, this one it, it is the build up to to be a really exciting game. Um, I think it gives a good weekend of weather. So. Uh, 6 30 saturday evening it, it could be something special here for both teams and and they, they both play the right style of football i think it'll, it'll hopefully be open in a high scoring game 